Hi, hi, hi. Hi, the teacher is here. How are you? Hi. Hi, guys. I think you cannot see me. Can you see me now? Yes, right? <laughs> Much better. Yes. Hey, Amilcar, where have you been? We missed you yesterday, actually. I know. <laughs> I know. And, and if you know why, what happened to you? I forgot the class. You forgot the class completely? Yes. <laughs> I, was, I was playing cards with my cousins. Uh-huh. And when, when I saw the, the clock, uh -huh. I said, oops, it's too late because it was uh, eight and, and half. Ah, no, but it was not too late. Oh, for me, so. Yeah, for you, yeah. <laughs> no, you can still come. Yeah, you know what happened is because uh, basically we had a long weekend, right? It was, yeah, it was. Friday until Thursday. So guys, don't forget that this week is going to be until Friday, okay? From Tuesday to Friday, do not forget that I'm going to be alone on Friday. No way. <laughs> okay, just to let you know. Uh -huh. I am, and I'm so happy that you that you remember today, Emilker. <laughs> and you yeah. Are, yeah, and you are here with us. So basically, I'm so happy to see you, and I'm happy that you're okay. Actually. Yeah, I'm great. <laughs> yeah, you feel much better about your pain on your back. On your neck? Yeah, I'm feeling a little bit tired today mm -hmm. because I I went to the bank. Oh, okay. Uh, and it's a it was a nightmare. Terrible. It was a Sorry? nightmare. It was a nightmare. Yeah, it was. I was waiting for almost two or three hours. Outside? Uh no. Oh. Waiting. Oh, just waiting, just waiting. But you were inside at the bank. Yeah. Oh my goodness, two or three hours for that? Oh no, but did, did, did you protect yourself? Uh, using did, mask? Yeah, everything. Yeah, Yeah. all when, the time. <laughs> when you arrive back home, did you, did you take a shower? Yeah, I yeah. did it. Okay, cool. Yes, because you, were, you spent like uh, too much time in one place. Yeah. yeah, by the way, I was in two banks. Oh, in two banks, even though. <laughs> yeah. yeah, it was worse than that. Yeah, because it was like an air conditioner, right? Yeah. So, okay, but I'm so happy that you're okay. And you came on time for today's class. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yay. Okay, don't worry. Um, uh, what I, my best recommendation will be that uh, you can go on the YouTube channel. The, the video is already there for yesterday's class. So you can just go there and double check a little bit. So you will have an idea what we saw yesterday, okay? Okay. Yeah, so you could be like in the same pace, right? Yeah, that would be my best recommendation. But you have a really smart uh, classmates that they will help you a lot, right? Jose, no, Jose, yes, Jose. <laughs> I pick Jose. Jose, welcome. Hi, how are you? Hi, good night. Good night. Jose, could you please make a refresh about what we saw yesterday? Do you remember, Jose? Okay, we saw the the simple pass. Uh-huh. And, and pass continues. Exactly, exactly. We saw those bird tenses in the past. Basically, basically, we saw the difference and how we can use together. Together to talk about something. That, for example, one um, activity started in the past and suddenly there was another activity that interrupted the first one. Okay? So we saw that. Remember, guys, that with simple past, which word we use? While or when? When. When exactly to join the two ideas, right? And while we use it with pass continuous. continuous, exactly. Hey, do you guys remember what was the formula or the verb that we use with pass continuous? The subject plus and the verb to be in past, yes, Danny. And what and what else? 
and the main verb. And the plus the verb plus ing. Exactly. Very good, Danny. And uh, of course, the complement, okay? So the, you will have like an idea. You see, you have a really tremendous smart classmate, Milker. There you go. That's what I love these guys. <laughs> Very good. Thank you, Danny. Thank you, Danny, for helping us. Okay, so this is what we saw yesterday. Today we're going to have so much fun, okay, because we're going to make, a, to play a game, guys, but this is a speaking game, okay, to make like a little refresh, okay, or oh, what we have seen, or what we saw yesterday. For those that were not here, don't worry, I'm not going to ask you, <laughs> okay? But just pay attention. I don't, and, and no, let me say, yay! Phew! <laughs> Thank you, teacher. You're so kind. Uh -huh. <laughs> but don't worry, after that, you're going to participate. It's okay. So, okay, don't worry, Naomi. Ash. <laughs> All right, also, Milka, so don't worry about that. Maria, okay? So that means that Humberto, Dani, Olguita, Maria Quintanilla, Mr. Fernando, Carlitos, Danny, Anita Mercedes, etc. All of you, you will participating, okay? <laughs> you will help a milker and also Noemi. Okay, I'm going to share right now my screen. And basically, guys, this is what I want you to do. I will show you the first part of one sentence. And then you need to continue the idea with the simple past, okay? For example, I can say, well, I, uh, on Saturday while I was walking down the street, and then you continue the idea, okay? That will be the, that, that will be the thematic for today. Okay, let me double check if you have understood yesterday's um, topic. Mr. Umberto, where are you? I cannot see. What's happening? There you go, my friend. I, and we cannot hear you, actually. Hi. 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 Oh, my Jen. goodness. Hi. Okay, yes. Woo. You're like, put, uh, oh, is my volume or is your volume? But like, oh, and I was like, oh, my God. <laughs> my ears, my poor ears. Okay. <laughs> Sorry for that. No, that's okay. Oh, my goodness. I think I need to uh, low down a little bit. Because <laughs> to be honest with you, I almost deaf. <laughs> all righty <laughs> hey you you, uh, you look so different are you are you cold yeah it's very cold really yeah <laughs> you have not been in a coldest place my friend <laughs> <laughs> oh, yes yes no i think i i've been in like like the coldest that i've been it would be like six like six degrees I, Six degrees. Mm -hmm, but I have never been below zero. No, never. Never in my whole life. No. If I I, I should have visited Russia, for example, right? <laughs> Russia or, yeah, Russia, you can be, a, let me check, in Siberia, Siberia, you could be like 50 below zero. And that, that, that should be horrible, my friend. I think uh, your bones hurt, right? Yes. Yeah, and your muscle, you're like almost practifier. I think so, because can you imagine 50 below zero? No. I can't imagine, no, I can't I, imagine that weather. Whew, no, that should be like, I think I will wear like 10 pairs of socks and four pairs of pants and like six uh, sweaters and four jackets. And I all still will be freezing. Yes, I can't imagine that. Oof. No, 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 no. So I'm, this, this weather for me is really nice. Is it not cold? <laughs> yeah, for me it's fine. Except for the wind, for the windy. Because I have a sign of problems. So the windy is not good for me at all. Okay, the wind is not good. But besides that, yes. But you cannot imagine, my pets have been uh, sleeping all day. <laughs> my two dogs, they were like, <sighs> right, exactly. <laughs> Can you imagine that? That's life, right? That's dog's life. Yeah, it's really nice. Yeah, they just sleep. I stand up, they go behind me. 
I, I come back to work, they are with me by on the bed. Can you imagine? <laughs> yeah, that's nice, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, without further speaking, okay, let me double check right now. I will share right now my screen with you. And uh, you let me know something. Bear with me for a moment. Let me know as soon as you're able to see my screen, okay? Hi, Adela, good, uh, good night. How are hey. you, bro? Pretty good? Yeah. Okay, that's yeah. cool. Okay, this is what we saw yesterday, Amilker. Okay, this is what we saw yesterday. So I will do a, like a little bit brief. Okay, th this was the exercise that we did uh, last night. Remember, guys? Okay. okay, now this one. Okay, do you see the, the sentences, guys? The first part of the sentences, of course. Do you see that? Yes. Okay, we have five of them. If you can see, guys, this is past continuous, okay? This is past continuous. Why we know, why we know that it's past continuous, guys? Why? Because of this. Take a look. Remember, first of all, we have while. Remember that we use a while with past continuous. And second of all, because we have here was and or where, right? But in this case, it's was, as Danny said. And then we have the ing form of the verbs. So basically, guys, all these sentences, all this part of the sentences, it must be past continuous. So this is what I want you to do. Okay, um, I will say the first part, and you need to come up with an idea to finish the sentence. But remember, guys, that in the second part, you're going to use simple pass, okay? So first victim, oh, thank you, first volunteer. And let me check, Danny, how are you, girl? <laughs> Fine, thank you. That's great, that's the spirit. Okay, let me give you the first sent part of the sentence and then you let me know uh, what will be the, the second part that you would like to add into this idea. Okay, while I was going home one day, what could have happened, Danny? With I ate a hamburger. You ate a hamburger, okay, very good, excellent. Any other idea for that, Olguita? Well, I was going home one day. Uh, maybe I fell down in the street. <laughs> you fell down in the street? Oops, <laughs> that's embarrassing, right? But nothing happens to you? Did you, uh, uh, I don't know, broke one arm, one leg? I don't know. <laughs> Only no? a hematoma. Oh my, my God. <laughs> On the bond. Okay, I'm so okay. I'm so sorry about that, <laughs> but but I'm I'm so happy that you're okay. Okay, next question, next sentence. I was doing my homework when Carlitos. Hello, mm -hmm. teacher. When, hello. Uh, when, my mother, when my mother came to home. Uh, when my mother came to home. <laughs> yes. Don't help him, Carlitos. <laughs> that, but, um, that was good. That was good. Okay. I was doing, doing my homework when I went to the supermarket with my friends. Ah, no, Carlitos. When I, when I went to the restaurant, for example. Ah, uh, aha. Uh -huh. I was doing my homework when you went to the restaurant. Yes. Uh, uh -huh. But you were I not driving, right? <laughs> you were not driving, right? Because you cannot drive and at the same time do your homework. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> I, I don't believe you. <laughs> just, just another idea, Carlito. Um, okay, I was doing my homework when mm -hmm. I, I received a call on uh -huh. the phone. Ah, okay, very good. That sounds more realistic. Very good, Carlito. <laughs> Excellent <laughs> job. <laughs> All righty. Number three, Umberto. I was talking to my friend when... When my girlfriend showed up. Ash, okay, very good. I think Umberto <laughs> loved his girlfriend, right? 
Yeah, he he always makes sentences with with uh, including her. So that's amazing, sir. <laughs> that's amazing. Very good job. Give me Joe five. <laughs> this is this last uh, two. They are a little bit complicated because basically they are just they just have one a period of time last month and two years ago. So let me double check who's going to be my big team. No, sorry, volunteer. Who can help me with that? Adela. Adelita, last month? Hi, teacher. The more difficult. <laughs> oh, come on. So in okay. this case, Adelita, you have to say last month. Think about last month, okay? Last month, you, it, it could be two days uh, in two months ago, or it could be any day. But remember what had happened last month, and you were doing something when something else happens, okay? Last month, I have vacation. You have, oh, you know, remember that the first part, Adelita, is with past continuous. The first part is past continuous. Last month, I was having my I vacation, was, for example. Okay. Last month, I having what? I having vacation. I have what I was having. I was having. <laughs> uh -huh. Very good. I was having my vacation when, when what happened? When I need, I... Past. I need to work. Uh, I no. Oh, oh uh -huh. no, 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 no. Remember that when, it's simple past, uh-huh. When? When I need to work. For example, you can say uh, when your boss call you, right? That you need to return back oh. to work, for example, for example. But don't use that one, okay? Mm. Use another one. Uh -huh. yeah. When my mm -hmm. when my no, I yeah. was in back I was having my vacation when qué pas qué pasó qué pasó when... Te, tenías estabas en vacaciones mm -hmm. cuando what happened ¿Qué pasó que te interrumpió tus vacaciones? ¿Qué hubiera pasado? ¿Qué podría haber pasado? Ah, when my when my coworkers was was not was sit when my coworkers your co-workers you said co-workers to company co yes uh -huh. Uh -huh. when my co-workers okay uh, is sick or was sick ah, okay when my co-worker was sick okay very good excellent was it was it then i need to work ah very good very good that that was excellent exactly Oof. Yeah, but don't complicate it much, okay? That's okay. I understand, but good job. Good job because you you, you did use the simple pass. That was hard, right? <laughs> okay. I'm a bad teacher. No, I'm just kidding. Okay, let me double check next victim. Sorry, next participant. And who else? Ah, Fernando. Hello, teacher. Hello, how are you, sir? Uh, very good. <laughs> That's nice to hear that because you need to okay. <laughs> help me with okay. this one. Two years ago, Fernando, remember? Uh, two years, two ago. years ago. What you were doing two years, two years ago. ago? Two years ago, I had an accident in I, my mother's car. Oh, I, I was, have, no, you can say it. Two years ago, I was driving with my mom, right? Who was driving, you or your mother? Can you even handle? Okay, so you can say I was driving. Yeah, uh, I, I, was. Dri I was driving my mother's house, my mother's car. Sorry, when? Tuve un accidente. Okay. How do you say that in English, guys? Tuve un accidente. How you say that in English, guys? Broke. 
Uh -huh. when, accident. I, when I had an accident, Eric. Oh, for the example, mm -hmm. uh, two years ago, I had an I had an accident in my mother car. Ah, okay. But remember, guy, remember, um, Fernando, that two years ago, you you use that expression with uh, past continuous. Okay. I, okay. I, okay. So the first part of the sentence has to be past continuous, and then. You can use the same information but with simple plus. Okay, teacher. Uh, so do it again. You can do it, sir. Uh, for okay, uh, two years ago, I had an accident in my mother's car when returning my home. Okay, and the, uh, the opposite way, al inversa, Fernando. Two okay. years ago, I was driving. Estaba manejando. I was driving my mother's car. Estaba manejando la, la carro de mi madre o de mi mamá. When, cuando, I got an accident. ¿Sí? Okay. When I had an accident. Dilo otra vez. You can do it. Come on. Ok, teacher. Uh, oh. Two years ago, mm -hmm. I, was, I was driving my mother cars. Mm -hmm. when, when I was returning my home. Ah, podría ser. No, no when I return it. Back home. Oh, okay. Acuérdate que es simple pass, ¿sí? When I return it back home. Y la, pr la okay. primera parte es my mother's car, porque es el carro de tu mamá, right? Okay. Okay, teacher. Si por la culpa de Fernando llegamos a las nueve, le dan, le dan este un chicharrón. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. Okay. One more time, Fernando. You can do it. Come on, sir. Okay. Mm -hmm. Two years ago, mm -hmm. I was driving my mother's cars. My mother's cars. Uh -huh. uh, I, my mother's cars, Gwen. Uh -huh. Very good. Gwen was returning my home. When was returning, guys? Or when I returned back home? Return it. You Return. see? Return. Okay, again, Fernando. <laughs> Again, okay. remember that the second part is simple pass, Fernando. Simple pass. Again. Okay, teacher. Mm -hmm. Go uh, ahead. Two years ago, mm -hmm. I, was, I was driving my mother cars. Mm -hmm. When I was return, return I was? my home. I was? I when, I, no, when, uh -huh. when, when I, I, I return my home. Very good. <laughs> Isn't it amazing when I returned back home? Okay, yeah, I think Fernando will will dream about me in uh, in past continuous and simple past. Definitely, <laughs> you see, Fernando, very good, very good, excellent. You okay, will never forget the use. Okay, remember two years ago or at while, etc. We use it with past continuous. In the second part with simple past to talk about actions in the past okay that's what we have done that right now i know it's really it's different when you see it than when you talk it right when you put it in practice it's totally different but now you know that so noemi you want to give a try <laughs> okay let's use the expression two years ago two years ago uh, two years ago we were in, we were in English class. Uh -huh. When the teacher said, uh -huh. I don't know, I don't know. I don't know. Very good. <laughs> <laughs> that was really interesting sentence. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. Very good. Good job, by the way. <laughs> Anita Mercedes. What? 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 Teacher, is it me? Yes. Now, of course, it's you. Anita, you want to give a try? You want to uh, give a sentence two years yes. ago? I know this. I do your, it? yeah, do your best. Uh, two years ago, I was receiving a puppy. Oh. When one birthday uh -huh. or birthday. What do you want to say? Um, cumpleaños en pasado. Uh, pronunciation, no good. Uh, uh, no, uh, birthday. 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 Uh -huh. birthday. 
Uh -huh. says, two years ago, I was received a puppy. When, no, when, what, my pride. Ah, okay. Uh, when, uh, okay, you can say that. But um, you, you want to say, for example, that two years ago, uh, you, uh, ah, okay. You, you can say something like that. Um, two years ago, I was receiving a puppy. Yeah? Yeah. When I celebrated my birthday, I celebrated, right? When I celebrated. I celebrated. Rem because remember that is simple past, it's right? One, when one celebrated. No, no. When, when I, when I. When I. When I celebrated my birthday. When I. Mm -hmm. Oh, very good. Very good. Excellent. Good job, Anita. Excellent. <laughs> Yay. You see? You broke my heart. Hey, very good. <clears throat> Amilcar, we wanna, you want to try? <laughs> yeah, why not? Uh, do your best. <laughs> okay, two years ago. Two years ago? Uh, two years ago, I was swimming in the river. Okay. Uh, when a crocodile came. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> no, uh, two years ago. Go. I was fishing in the river ah, when fishing, I received okay. the call. Okay, when you received the call, okay. From yeah. who? I'm just kidding, no. From my too, too much information <laughs> that we're not supposed to know, okay. Okay, very good. <laughs> Helena, Helen, Mercedes, would you like to try? Yes. Okay, do your best. Thank you. Um, uh, two years ago, Mm -hmm. I was walking to the bank mm -hmm. when I, my, 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 yeah, I don't remember. Oh my God, how you say, how do you say uh, that part of your body in English, P.A.? How do you say that in English? Boot. 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 Yeah. Yes. My boot. Uh -huh. When your foot, what happened with your foot? Uh huh. What happened with your foot, Anita, Helen? Sorry, sorry, I didn't listen. You said two years two years ago I was walking to the bank when my foot what? Broke. When oh, I you? broke my foot. Oh my goodness! I'm sorry for you. <laughs> uh, it was true. Yeah. Yeah. Ooh. Oh, that hurts. Ugh. That was weird, but yeah, it happens. <laughs> yeah, I know. You fall down. You were wearing heels. Or what happened? I was walking in the on the street, mm -hmm. and there was a una gradita. I don't, don't How you say I that? Know. There was a little stair, right? A little stair. So I just uh, you didn't I see put it. Put my my right foot. I think it was, I I put my foot in the bad way. Ah, uh, okay. Like this. And oh, you were running or just walking normally? Walking. Normally. Yeah, normal. Okay. Yeah. Maybe, uh, did you, uh, did you get distracted for some reason? No. Maybe because I was mm -hmm. uh, checking that the cars that I can, um, past the, the street. Ah, okay. okay. So you were paying attention about the traffic, yeah? Exactly, uh -huh. on the traffic. Any yeah. other questions that you'd like to, to ask Helen about her situation, guys? Any other questions? We're going to practice follow-up questions right now. Follow-up questions when something happens to you, okay? Okay. Any other question, guys? I already asked her a lot. What about you? Uh-huh. Noemi, Amilcar, Humberto. Any question that you would like to ask Helen about her accident? Uh, for, did you receive uh, any medical attention in close hospital? Very good, yes. Carlitos. Thank you, Carlitos. I I went to the hospital and they put me a a boat a boat a boat a boat a boat. Yeah, for two months. For two oh. months. Well, yes. Okay. Oh my goodness! And talking about yes. the boot, guys, Melvin. Any questions regarding the boot? 
Ay, teacher. Oh, Welcome back. My, my wife. Thank you. Thank you. Mm -hmm. You're my welcome. My wife uh, was uh, was this this same accident with oh. her foot. Oh my goodness! She had uh, that same accident. Ew. Yes. Yes. So, so you have an idea uh, how is three, it? Right? Three years. Three years ago. Three years ago. Three years ago. Ooh. Yeah. He he she. he used this booth about around she. one month. One month. Ooh. Yes. So so you can ask something to Helen, right? Ask yes. her something about the boot. Helen, this yeah. boot is uh, comfortable for you? Uh, was it comfortable? Uh, it you? wasn't. It wasn't. It wasn't at all. Why not? Because I have, mm -hmm. I had to use muleta. <laughs> uh -huh. How do you say that in English? I had to use that. Ah, come on. Come on, you don't know how to say muleta in English? No, we'll kill you, Chris. Mm, I don't know how to say muleta. <laughs> that, that will be your homework. Yeah. Search for so muleta. I had to use it to go to, go to work. Mm -hmm. So, and uh, after the, the two months, mm -hmm. my, my, right, my right leg was skinnier than the other one yeah it was like really weird right yeah, oh my yeah, god and, and it was weird I, yeah i i feel like creepy <laughs> yeah right yeah, it was creepy <laughs> like two centimeters yeah exactly like and, and you know what it was uh, i think the color of your of your skin changed right yeah <laughs> one leg was uh, white and the other one was a little bit dark a little bit dark the 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 other one was the the right leg uh -huh. was the, the the injury and oh. the left one yeah dark <laughs> yeah. okay so weird. exactly so with the left uh, everybody sees that you went to the gym but with the right one no right <laughs> yeah exactly so you had more muscles in the left one than in the right one oh my goodness yeah um, and it was itchy right itchy yeah a lot mm -hmm. but yeah, only like... the first two weeks yes and you like to like yeah. and you can and you couldn't right you just look yeah. and just like a tube to get into the boot and like exactly oh my, you know it. <laughs> oh my god that uh, you see hey guys you know, we're talking about that not to just spend time, right? You see, right now what we're doing, we're practicing um, asking follow-up questions when somebody, for example, is telling us a story, okay? Like in this case, Helen Mercedes is telling us a, her accident, okay? You guys, you see, we started using what we have seen yesterday. Past continuous with simple past. Now, Without you uh, notice, sin que notaran, without you notice, we already inter, uh, introduced a new topic, right? And we were listening to Helen Mercedes and we were asking her follow up questions. This is really important, guys, because if you ask follow up questions, that will help you like to communicate much better and the conversation being more fluently. Yes? Not like, uh, like for example, like some girlfriend, boyfriend that they said, hi, hi. How are you? Fine. And you? Only that. Okay. And that's all. Like, oh my God. And what am I going to ask this guy? What am I going to ask this girl? Right? What else can I say? No way. You see? We need to be more fluent in a, in a conversation. It has to be conversational. Okay? And the only way is to use follow-up questions. Like what we have done right now with Helen. Now, guys... Also, we have, we're going to see something really important today. And this, for example, Helen is telling us a story, a story that had happened to her. So we're going to see right now, guys, uh, we're about to see some verbs, some adverbs, sorry, that we use to, uh, when we're talking about storytellers, okay? Storytellers, when we're talking about stories, okay? Who, who can let me know? Who loves to tell the stories? Who? Anybody? Yes, Adelita. 
Me too. What about you, Helen? What about you, Carlitos? What about you, Amilker? Olguita? Anybody? Hello. I think we have it. Yes. Yes, Olguita? Hey. Yes. Okay. So I think most of you guys love to tell the stories, right? For example, what Fernando said that something happens with him in his mother's car uh, two years ago, right? So basically, all of us guys loves to tell stories about things that had happened to us in the past. So there are some adverbs that they're very useful when we would like to talk about that. Uh, let me show you right now my screen. And so we can start seeing those, that information, okay? Uh, before I continue, any questions, guys? No? Are you okay? No. no? Okay, okay. Do me a favor. Tell me as long as you're able to see my screen. But guys, I don't know what happened, if it's my uh, uh, internet or it's yours, but uh, everybody's frozen. <laughs> like, <laughs> yeah. Some of you moves, like for example, Carlitos, right? <laughs> and Jose. <laughs> and, and Noe, Noemi. But Rona is like. <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> yeah, he's, he's like, he's creepy, like, right? Ronald, come on, Ronald. <laughs> okay, now, yes, because I can see you moving. I'm so happy. You were like, what's going on here? Okay, so let me just a couple of minutes. So let me share right now my screen. And Ronald, please don't do that creepy thing. <laughs> All righty. There you go. Okay. Uh, can you see it, guys? Or would you like me to make it a little bit bigger? Bigger will be fine? More bigger, please. Okay, bigger. Okay. There you go. Okay, that is what we have see or we have done, okay? Uh, Follow-up questions. There you go. Can you see it now, guys? Is it much better? Yes. Okay. Yes. Yeah. Thank okay. you. You're more than welcome. Okay, guys, so we do have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10, I think 10 adverbs uh, that we use to talk about storytelling. Okay, well, we'd like to tell a story about what had happened to us. And guys, uh, what is the reason that we use those adverbs? You see this one, let's see, adverbs, storytelling, to what? To emphasize. To emphasize that something interesting is about to happen, right? Or had happened. Okay, guys. So basically, guys, what we like to double check is which others of this list of this list are positive, which words are negative, and which one could be either positive or negative. Okay. For example, the first one, coincidentally. What do you think, guys? Either. Is it positive or negative? Or either? Either. Either? either? either. Okay. All right. Very good. So it could be either. All right. What about fortunately? Positive. 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 Okay. okay. We can put like this. Positive. All right. What about luckily? Positive. 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 Very good. Luckily. Luckily. What about miraculously? Positive. Too. Positive. Positive. Okay. Yes. What about sadly? Negative. 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 Strangely? Negative. 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 Suddenly? Negative. Either. Either. It could either. be either, right? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. It, it could be comes from something positive or negative. Depends. Uh, surprisingly? Positive. 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 Um, Unexpectedly? Either. 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 Mm -hmm. Yeah, it could be either. Okay, and unfortunately? Negative. 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 All right. Okay. Oops, no, what's negative? Right? And I was doing positive. Come on, teacher. Okay, very good. Okay, I'm sorry for my handwriting, right? So I'm sorry for that, but you understand what I'm talking about. Okay, guys. So let's practice the pronunciation, okay? Repeat after me. Coincidentally. 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 Fortunately. 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 Luckily. 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 Miraculously. 
Miraculously. Miraculously. Sadly. Sadly. Strangely. Suddenly. Surprisingly. Unexpectedly. Unfortunately. Very good. Tell me, guys, from this um, adverbs, is there something that you don't know what does it mean? No? For example, what is coincidentally in Spanish, guys? Coincidentemente. Uh, coincidentemente. Very good. Remember, it's an yeah. adverb, yes? Uh, uh, los adverbs terminan en mente in Spanish, right? Mente. Okay. Fortu fortu fortunately. Afortunadamente. Very good. It's the opposite of? Unfortunately, right? Afortunadamente. Very good. Luckily. Suertu. Con suertulamente, right? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. O con suertemente. Suertemente, right? Suertemente. Miraculously. Milagrosamente. Sadly. Tristemente. Strangely. Fuertemente. Ah, no, es extraño. Extraño. Exactly. Exactly. Yeah. Suddenly. De repente. De repente. De repente. Repentinamente. Yeah. Ya ven, ustedes saben más español que yo. Repentinamente. Very good. Surprisingly. Sorprendentemente. Sorpresivamente. Very good. Unexpectedly. Inesperadamente. Very good. Okay, guys. So, while we're doing that, uh, because we can use those adverbs to emphasize a story that happens, okay? Y esto es lo que quiero que hagan con esto. Déjeme ver. Teacher, ¿qué va a hacer usted? Ah, okay. ¿Qué va a pasar ahorita? Ajá. Ya van a ver. Ay, teacher, usted con sus misterios. Yes. I'm a mystery teacher. All righty. Very good. Let me share something with them. All right. There you go. Okay. This is what I want. Okay. I will send you something to the WhatsApp and please be so kind to let me know if you are able to receive it, okay? Please. Tell me as long as you're able to receive it. Let me check, there you go. Where are you guys? Okay, there you go. Okay. Uh, did you guys receive it? Yes. yes. Okay. Yes. Okay. This is what I want. If you can see, guys, uh, you can select a uh, one date of your life. It doesn't matter which one. Okay. But basically, what I want, guys, is that you do a little paragraph, like the one that I sent it to you right now, explaining the situation of what had happened. Okay. Tell us a brief story. A brief story about what happens to you. And uh, I will give you exactly, let me check, um, three minutes to do that. Using, guys, the adverbs that we have seen. Let's practice that. Uh, who can help me read it? Eh, Maria Quintanilla, do me a favor. Could you please be so kind to read it for me, the example that I sent it to you right now through the WhatsApp group? Okay. Hey. I was visiting the coast last year when unexpectedly I got a change to go kayaking. Mm -hmm. Fortunately, it was a perfect day mm -hmm. and I was having a great time. Mm -hmm. The water was calm and I was beginning to feel a little tighter when suddenly very good, exactly. So you see, guys, how, how this person used the adverse to emphasize what happened to the story? Okay, so this is what I want, okay? Pick one day, whatever day you would like to, 
and I just want to, to, to do this paragraph exactly like that. Okay, uh, what, what happened to you? Anita Mercedes, do you understand what you're going to do? Um, it's an example mm -hmm. uh, equal um, the this um, screen. Aha, uh -huh. but something that happens to you, Anita. A situation yes. that happens to you and using the adverbs, los adverbios that we have seen right now, que acabamos de ver, ¿sí? Okay. Yes, uh, cortito. Yes. Three or four uh, lines, that's all. Okay, I will give you <laughs> three minutes. And then we come back together. Y después, and then we're going to share. Vamos a compartir the stories, okay? A ver cuál es la más terrible. Okay? <laughs> I will give you three minutes. You can start right now. I'll be right back, okay? I'll be okay. here. If you want to ask me any question, I'll be here. Okay, time is over. Sorry. Okay, who, who wants to start? Uh, let me double check. Amilcar. <laughs> My goodness. Uh huh. <laughs> Would you like to start? I didn't do anything. <laughs> Why you didn't do anything? I don't know. I don't have nothing to, to say. I come on. Don't tell me that. Something? I'm not really good telling stories. You're not. You have to give a try. <laughs> ah. Uh -huh. Do do your best. I will give you a uh, one minute to think about it. Okay. Anything that happens to you, it could be something good. It could be something bad. Okay. Or for example, you can tell us something about what happened yesterday that you forgot to be in English class. You can use that example. Okay. I have uh -huh. an idea. Uh -huh. So, two weeks ago, uh -huh. I was visiting my friend on the beach. Okay. Uh, suddenly, mm -hmm. I, or we started to drink. Uh, okay. That's interesting. Water. <laughs> ah, ah, okay. We need to finish that. Okay, sorry. We need to let you finish the sentence. Okay, go ahead. Yeah. When he told me uh, that he, who will have a part, uh -huh. but suddenly, I didn't have an idea and I didn't get a gift. Okay, that was good. Not too bad. <laughs> Very good job, excellent. It was hard, right? Because some, some, some of us, we do not have that capacity like Milker said. 
That's perfectly fine, Amilka, but you did a really good job. Yay, congratulations. Very good. Next victim, sorry, next participant. Ronald Humberto, you have a pretty good smile today, sir. So very good. <laughs> okay, let's listen. It's, it's a sad story, oh, but... Oh, okay, don't make me cry, please. I, I was talking with my ex-girlfriend. Ex mm, you see the girlfriend, okay. No, my ex-girlfriend. <laughs> sorry, sorry, oops. <laughs> so when my girlfriend heard the conversation... Ooh, that was a drama, okay. Miracles, mi miraculously. <laughs> miraculously, she <laughs> was thinking that was my mother. But suddenly, my mom was knocking the door. Oh my goodness! So, uh -huh. in for, <laughs> so <laughs> unfortunately, my girlfriend left me. Ooh. And Helen was like, oh my God. <laughs> he, he screwed up. I'm just kidding. Okay, very good. Metió la pata. Okay, that was really good use of hours, okay? to emphasize the story. Very good. Excellent job, sir. Give me all five. That was really good. Very good. Yay. Okay, let's listen to other story. Jose, what about your story, sir? Sorry, I don't finish the story. You have not finished? Okay, we'll give you one minute more and then I'm going to ask Danny. Danny, what about you, Danny? Okay. Um, I was going home from school a few years ago when mm -hmm. suddenly a motorcycle appeared Ooh. and ran over me <gasps> and then I went to the hospital but fortunately nothing bad happened to me. Oh my goodness. Oh, if that happens to you? Does it really happen? Yes, to you? yes, it's a, oh, it's a real story. It's a real, oh my god. How old were you? I think nine years old. You were nine years old. Oh my God, yes. you were a, a little baby by then. Yes, I know. <laughs> uh, oh, yeah, you see? Yes, I know. I was a little baby. <laughs> no, all right. You don't want to ask her something, guys, or what happened to her? If that affects something right now that she's an adult, I don't know. Any ideas? Using follow up questions, guys, please. Carlitos, that you always ask good questions. I don't know. Would you like to ask something to Danny about her car motorcycle accident? Ah, uh, teacher, sorry. <laughs> I, I was riding. But my... I was riding. I was not paying attention to her. Sorry, Danny. <laughs> Danny. I was no riding. I was riding. Okay. Now you can see how, how much love your classmates have for you. Okay? So. <laughs> I'm just kidding, Danny. Okay? Very no, good. No, no. No problem. <laughs> <laughs> That's okay. Okay. Mm-hmm. This is really interesting, classmates, okay. Very good. Olguita, what about you? Tell me. Tell us your story. Um, when I, no, I was visiting uh, my mother's house, mm -hmm. when I unexpectedly, the dogs appear in, the, in my way mm -hmm. and starting, starting, yes, um, and dogs, you said? Is, yes, the it's, dogs it's started. Start, started. started uh, bark. Barking? Yes, uh -huh. and I, uh -huh, I, I stay in shock. Uh huh. Okay. Ooh. Because I'm, I'm afraid of dogs. Ooh. Okay. I don't know why, but I'm afraid, and and don't and I don't say it, and uh, and don't say anything, and. Mm -hmm. I stay here, here, there, uh -huh. sorry. Okay. And um, fortunately, the neighbor is up here mm -hmm. and I, <laughs> and I helped me to uh, cross the, the, the way. Yeah. Cross the, the, es que no había terminado. <laughs> okay, that's okay, that's okay, very oh. good. But I'm sorry, what had happened to you? Okay, thanks God that they do not bite you, right? They do not bite you. Because if not, that will, was, that will be really hard. Oh my goodness. I love dogs, so that never happens to me. <laughs> I know. Yeah, but I do have a friend that also had happened the same situation. 
So wow, sorry for that, Olguita. Thanks God nothing happened yes. to you. Only all, no. only that we were in chat. Okay. Yes, yes. Who else? Maria Quintanilla, what about you, girl? <laughs> Teacher. Very short. Okay, I know. But, okay. We were going on vacation the last Holy Week. Mm -hmm. Unfortunately, the COVID-19 appeared. Yeah. We lost the expected vacation. Oh my God. I'm so <laughs> sorry about that. And you like do, do you like her face? Like <laughs> yes. Okay. She emphasized it very well, by the way. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. Yes. Well, yes. sadly, you need to stay home, right? Sadly. Yes. Yeah. Uh, yes. That was really good. Excellent. Very good, <laughs> Maria. Very good. Uh, Melvin, it's your turn. Okay. My wife just working in her office when mm -hmm. unfortunately she had an injury in her foot mm -hmm. coincidentally the same injury like helen mm. the doctor says she had to use a booth two months unexpectedly she started to feeling a suddenly itch mm. she, she was desperate and we had to cut the booth unfortunately this made her feel better very good. This may help her much better. Excellent job. Excellent job. Great job. Oh, guys, you rock right now. You're rocking. Very good. Excellent. Good job, Melvin. Who else? Carlitos, now is your turn. Okay, teacher. This is a, a sad, sad, sadly story. Uh, also, like Humberto? No way. No, 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 no. Ah, uh, uh, okay. Uh, okay, uh, the last Friday. I was visiting another facility for the company. Mm -hmm. The facility has different, the, also the company has different facility. Mm -hmm. Suddenly, uh, human resource called me about they fired out uh, a person. Ooh. Okay, you, wow. <laughs> um, me, by the way. Mm? <laughs> it was uh, sur surprisingly for me. Yeah. Uh, but the human resource explaining uh, the, the, Okay, the situation, uh, luckily for me, I, I was not fired, but the, uh, unfortunately for the IT person from this, uh, this facility, this plant, was fired. Uh, so. Oh my God, that it was a really sad story. Yes. <laughs> Nowadays, right, with the quarantine that we need a job, right? To survive um, and everything, oh my goodness. Yes, but uh, I think they had uh, several, several reasons. Mm -hmm. uh, yes, to, to make that to decision. decision. Mm -hmm. Yes, definitely, yeah. Hopefully that guy or girl saves some money on the bank, right? Just in case, for yes, future. For, for today is very important. Yes, it is really important. Thank you so much for sharing that, and it's a really sad story. Yes, it is. Yes, that's, that's, it was, it was very uh, surprising for me. Yeah, hey. definitely. <laughs> well, yeah, but but at the first time, I think it was really shock and shock, right? Because yes. like, okay, they're talking about me. Am I going to be viral or what? <laughs> oh, oh yeah, I know, but that's good that you're not and you are still here with us. Yay! <laughs> Very good. Let's listen to one of the youngest in the group. <clears throat> it's not the youngest. It's one of the junk people, Mr. Fernando and Surincon. Hello, sir. That is a tango by the name. Hello, Hello teacher. Hello, now it's so torn. Let's listen to your story, please. Okay, my story is short, teacher. Okay, it's go about ahead. it's about a uh, bad experience. Oh, okay. Oh, oh, guys, okay. you only tell me <laughs> bad experiences. Okay, okay, very good. I was I was hearing when mm. hearing when strangely strangely in the soup I found an animal. Uh huh. Everything. Everything was going well until that moment. Mm -hmm. Unfortunately, 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 the, unfortunately, mm -hmm. the waiter, the waiter had to run away the food. Mm -hmm. Only that teacher. <gasps> so you were eating in a restaurant and you found an animal on your food? Yes, teacher. Really? It, it was, it was a a cockroach. Mosquito. No. Ah, 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 oof, a mosquito. <laughs> Thanks God yeah. it was not a cockroach. Oh, if you were not Chinese, you would eat the cockroach, but no way. Okay. Oh my goodness. Did they change the dish, the plate? Did 
Did they give you something different? I don't know. No, teacher. Uh, no, I, no I, I, I no longer visit the restaurant. Ah, okay. Yes, because of the bear experience. I understand. Now, yeah, yes, teacher. Did they return the money back? <laughs> <laughs> okay, very good. Excellent. And <clears throat> next victim, sorry, next participant. Noemi, what about you? It's a chore, it's about food, but no, it's sad. Uh, it's, not, it's not sad, okay? Thanks okay. God, it's not sad, okay. <laughs> last, weekend, last weekend, I was eating a hamburger. Yay. When mm. suddenly, I remembered that I had avoca avocado mm -hmm. to make a sauce. Ah, fortunately, sauce, uh-huh. Mm. Fortunately, I can prepare the sauce, and this changed the flavor of the hamburger. Mm. Really? Well, it was a, a, a meat hamburger, a fish, or a chicken hamburger? Meat, but the sauce is delicious. Change mm, the flavor. Really? Totally. Yes. Totally change it's it. Totally. It's <laughs> easy to prepare. Okay, so you can do us a favor. Maybe you can send to the WhatsApp and you don't have to forget. Also, Adela, right? Adela was supposed to send us a recipe. Ha! And she forgot. You can send us the recipe of the avocado sauces. Okay. Yes. Yeah. Yes. You know why? Because I remember that um, the Melvin, when we were talking about food and preparation last model, he shared some recipe about bean soup. I remember that. And he said, teacher, I added uh, Lorocco. And I was like, Lorocco on the bean soup? I, I had tried Lorocco in the chicken soup, right? But, but nothing on the, on the bean food. Yeah teacher tried it it's really good and you know what melvin i put in practice your recipe today i made a well, this is not the first time I, I made a a bean soup yeah for my family actually for dinner and i added and wow it is really delicious what do you think, what do you think? yeah you are right you're totally right man it was really good so he's a really good chef by the way at least with only soup. teacher only have a problem because i don't have a quantity is you only I, mix and, and try a uh, taste, taste, and when you yeah. taste good, finish. <laughs> yeah, oh, that, that, that depends on each person, right? Yeah, as yeah. long as we know what are the ingredients in the procedure mm -hmm. to follow, and that's it. Doesn't okay. matter about the quantity, okay? Yeah, but share okay. with us. That would be amazing. Thank okay. you. And last but not least, who can help me? Wendy, would you like to try? Or Helen? Hello. Hello, Wendy. Yes, but my connection was unstable. Oh, okay. And I don't know what are you talking about. Ah, okay. So don't worry about it, okay? Okay, I'm going I'm going to ask you tomorrow, okay? Just listen, Helen, okay? okay. Helen, okay. Helen, how is your turn? You're lucky girl. Very good. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Hey, you're okay. Welcome. My friends and I were traveling to the beach mm -hmm. when suddenly a motorcycle crashed with my friend car. With your friend's Unfortunately, car? Wow. my, yeah. Unfortunately, the motorcycle driver had many injuries. So unfortunately, oh, yeah. Was, yeah. <laughs> uh, okay, every, everybody is fine. Uh, only for that. Yeah. Every, everybody. Wow. No, and things died that he was he was alive, right? It's a, yeah. The same it, biker. Is. The same biker like Danny. Yeah. Exactly. And, and, no, wait, Melvin, don't be like that. Don't be so mean. <laughs> and, and the teacher said, "Yes, exactly. Come on, don't be like that, Melvin." <laughs> the, the same biker. The same biker. It could. It might be. It might be. It might be not. <laughs> It, may, it maybe was a family of that biker, okay? That could be. <laughs> oh, my God. Yeah, Rizzy. I'm sorry that had happens to you, Dad. But you know what? He, the motorcycle man was really lucky. Because if you imagine a motorcycle crashed to a car, oh, my yeah. God. That is a totally different. Depends on the speed that the motorcycle was. He could pass away in the accident, in the crash exactly. moment. Oh my and goodness. Thanks God uh, there wasn't another car. Yeah, exactly. Uh, yeah. Because if not, that will that would have been really, really worse. Worse, yes. Not only for the motorcycle guy, but also for you guys. 
Yes. Oh Thanks my God. God. Yeah. Thanks God. Okay. You almost, almost made me cry. Okay. For me, that was the saddest story. <laughs> we are sadly. Yeah. Oh, guys. Sadly. Hey, but you know what? I'm really happy uh, right now with you guys because you have really used very good the passive voice, the simple pass, and also the adverbs to uh, to talk about storytelling. Great job, guys. Excellent job. You make me feel like dancing. No, you make me feel so proud of you, okay? Very good job. I'm Milker, sorry, but time is over. So we're going to hear your story tomorrow, okay? And also Maria yeah. Colindres. Also you, I'm going to listen your story tomorrow, Maria Colindres, because I know that you're working, okay? So don't worry about that. Okay, guys, uh, any questions, any doubts? No? And also, Anita Mercedes, we're going to hear your story tomorrow. Okay, Anita? Okay, guys, I'm so happy to see you once again. You cannot imagine how happy I am every time that okay. I see your faces, your beautiful faces. All righty. Tomorrow, it will be our second, you know, third day, right? Don't forget, guys, that this week is going to be until Friday, Okay. So please don't forget <laughs> Amilcar, okay? Imagine the teacher will be alone on Friday, no way. Okay, only for this week, okay? Okay, okay guys. So yeah. no homework for today. Yee okay, very yeah. good. Yeah, I know that you're so happy. And, and Melvin say yes. Okay. <laughs> so hacks and kisses. And see you guys tomorrow, okay? Bye. 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 Bye.